one night stand once and uh, it was a terrible experience. I'm not going to use the word apocalyptic, but me and the young lady in question, uh, we met at a house party, maybe two o'clock in the morning. You know, one of those situations where you see someone, your eyes meet across a crowded room, everyone's drunk and lonely and desperate. You lock eyes and you realize that you're looking, each of you are thinking, ah, oh, that person is the sexiest person remaining. <laughs> so I wandered over. I said something, my opening line was something charming and debonair, like, uh, <laughs> She responded in kind. <laughs> <laughs> Consequently, we had an awkward fumble, a bit of an awkward snog, and then I nodded hopefully towards the stairs. She looked at me with a mischievous glint in her eye, and she said, yeah, I suppose. <laughs> and off we went upstairs. Now, what happened, I don't know how to describe it, we were not making love. We certainly were not making love. We weren't even making like. <laughs> we were making do. <laughs> I don't know if you've ever made do. It's profoundly unsatisfying. And bless her, at one point she tried to spice things up with a little bit of feedback. She looked up at me and she went, harder, harder. I don't like that. <laughs> That's criticism, isn't it? It's not sexy. <laughs> it's complaining. Harder. She might as well be going better. <laughs> Bigger. <laughs> Someone else. You know, I, I don't know how you're supposed to respond to that kind of comment in the moment. If someone goes harder, you can't very well go, no. <laughs> Sorry, I, I said harder. I heard you, <laughs> Missy. <laughs> this is as hard as it goes. It only has two settings. <laughs> In and out. <laughs> For your information, it is currently... In. <laughs> and you certainly can't, you can't ever go tighter. That's unacceptable. <laughs> Thanks for having me, ladies and gentlemen. Have a great festival.